Okay, I've put all the rocks back in its or in their place. You can see. I've just got to paint some more. But the next job I'm going to do is paint this base all green because um, a lot of it's going to be grass and also some will be gravel but I thought I'd paint it all green first and the two walls will be painted grey and up top will be maybe gravel or, or grass as well Anyway, at least the rock walls back up. Okay, I've painted the whole base green. But some gravel will still be going on. And also I've painted the rocks. So it's back to normal. And I've painted the, the rock walls to grey. Up top still could be some more gravel or grass. And that's what she looks like all green. Okay, the next step on the trailer park is I want to put gravel down in places where it's got to go. So obviously the tunnel is going to have gravel coming down like so. So we'll put some gravel down. Just like so. So what I'll do is I'll put it down and show you what it looks like. Okay, all the gravel's just been scattered around. Just some in the centre, as you can see. And then out from the tunnel. Just to break open, but it's just not all grass. I'll go ahead and glue that down. Okay, all the gravel is now being glued down, so it's all hard as a rock. But I'm not liking the green colour, so I'm going to go over the green with a, a brown colour. So I'll go ahead and paint all that brown. take away the green okay all the greens paints going now it's all sort of a brown color
Okay, now I'm going to start putting some grass on and I'll just put PVA glue down and now I'm going to put the grass down. Now I'll let that, um, that part dry and then I'll carry on with the rest. So I'll show you what it looks like at the end. Okay, all the grass is down. I've just got to wait for it to dry. In some places I've used two and three millimetre grass height. But when I vacuum on it, vacuum it all up, a lot of this will go. So I'll let that all dry, and then I'll lift it up. And just another view from the other side. Okay, the static grass is now, now down. And some of this grass is, most of it's two to three mil high. And this part is about four to five mil. And this one's about two to three mil. So that's what she looks like all down and finished. And now for the placing of the trails. Okay, look at some of the trailers I've got. Now this is the gr grilling and chilling trailer. which obviously comes with lights already in it and the uh, roof comes off and then inside you'll see the light and and the interior And with the veranda at the front, with some deck chairs, the gas bottles, and a view at the back, and also comes with a water tap. So that's the first one. And the second one is sunny days, which obviously comes with table and chairs and another water tap. That's the back side of it and the front side with lights as well. And inside it has a light and the interior as well. Put that one. 
Another. And the next one is the double decker trailer. And comes with a trash can, like a picnic table, the taps again, and a gas bottle. And that's the front side. And that's the rear side. And the roof slides off as well. And inside is the light. And this one also has a TV that flickers in the side there. that one aside and also I've got an IMAX item number 6124 another IMAX item number 6122 And also, I made these two kits up, which is the silver version of the caravans, and then other caravans will also be going on. So I just thought I'd show you some of the items going on. And that's the box the caravans come in, which is a Bosch 1054 trailer park. And also, I brought a camping kit from Bosch, which is number 6044. And these are like plastic tents, as you can see. Some I'm just going to paint. And then you also get a whole lot of accessories but I'm not going to use them all so I'll paint all them up and also put them on the layout 